The following tutorial will demonstrate how to order advanced imaging studies in Sorian Clinicals while complying with the Protecting Access to Medicare Act of 2014. Under this program, at the time a practitioner orders an advanced diagnostic imaging service, he or she will be required to consult a Qualified Clinical Decision Support Mechanism, or CDSM. CDSMs are electronic portals through which appropriate use criteria is accessed. The CDSM provides a determination of whether the order adheres to appropriate use criteria. A consultation must take place at the time of ordering the imaging service. In Sorian Clinicals when ordering, the CDSM is integrated into the EHR. The CDSM we use in Sorian Clinicals is CareSelect. This tutorial I'll demonstrate three different orders going into the going into the CDSM. The first will be a chest CT. You simply access the patient. We want to go down to radiology studies under CAT scan and we'll get the simple chest CT. Under this new program, when I go to order a CT, an MRI, a PET scan, or nuclear medicine imaging, it will take me to the new CDSM. You'll see this part in the middle of the order. Once this pops up, you will be required to consult the CDSM. If I attempt to do the order without it, you'll see I will get prompted to, to, to use the CDSM. So I click in this drop down, you'll see three, three different selections. Consult the system. That's what you want to do when ordering any advanced imaging study. The exception is designed for emergent purposes where you do not have time to access the CDSM. The third is if you do not access the CDSM from the integrated method within Sorian and you need to transcribe information into the order. This will probably never be used by our staff within the hospital walls. So I'm going to consult the system. Right now it's taking me out to the care select model. I'm putting in the reason for the exam. This patient's short of breath. I'm thinking maybe they have a PE. So I'm just going to simply type in short of breath. I could select a more specific reason down here from PE. So I'm going to select PE with the positive D dimer. The system is now going out, searching the appropriateness of the study. So you'll see here a CT of the chest for somebody with shortness of breath that we're looking for a possible PE that has a positive D dimer. Gives us a high appropriateness score, a score of nine. So to order this study, I simply confirm and order the study. You'll see some information, pre-populate the order. It gives me the appropriateness score, the CDSM number, and it, what they call a G code. That's what, re that's what is required by CMS to meet the act. So I could just simply order and finish this study. Now my study is ordered. That is a nice clean order, simple to do. The next order I'm going to show you is an MRI of the brain. So we'll simply go down to our radiology studies. We'll go to MRI. Come down here, MRI of the brain. We'll do with and without contrast. We're going to again go in. We're going to consult the system. It's going to take me out to the care select system. I'm going to do this study. Say we have somebody that comes in with ataxia or dizziness. We're going to put the reason in. Okay. So it's giving me it's giving me a couple options here. I'm going to say this is a neuro deficit with a possible stroke. Okay, and you'll see this is coming up with no score. So ideally, it's giving me some options here. Do I want to order the CT or I could possibly order this MRI at a brain? In this case, I'm going to order the MRI at a brain, so I'm going to replace the order. What the system is doing, it's replacing the, the previous MRI study with the new one of the MRI of the brain. 
With Care Select and its integration with Sorian, when I replace a study within the Care Select software, I do have to go back into the, the detail of the order just to review it. I see that the score is eight. It has all my appropriate information and I could simply hit apply and then sign the order. And that order is in the system. Mm -hmm. There is, what I'm gonna demonstrate to you is the, is the ability to do, order a study with an, as an exception. So let's go back and we'll go back to our CAT scan. Mm -hmm. okay. So let's say we wanted to do that CAT scan Cat scan of the cat scan of the head here. Let me get down here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's do a cat scan of the head and neck combined. We're gonna add this study. Mm -hmm. Let's say this was an emergent situation and I did not have time to go in and consult the CDM. I can hit the exception. And you'll see when I go to order this study using the exception, it's going to require me to put in a reason for the study and also why I'm doing the exception. So we're going to say this is an emergency medical condition. And we're going to put in for the study, let's say we have a headache. Hit order and finish. Sign the order. Now you see the order added. That concludes the tutorial for the use of CareSelect with the integration into Sorian Clinical.